Ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, today is another episode. We are now in uh, episode uh, seven of uh, the roadmap to Biafra by our brother Barrister Emeka. We do not know Biafra. I got to know today. You will be free to call in to ask questions because. Barrister is well prepared. As you can see him, I can see you can see his face today. Barrister is shining. Barrister, your people is sending special likes, special mm. greetings you. to you. you. And Thank there you. is a call on the line. We have not yet started. Should we listen to him? <laughs> oh yes, you can okay. take Hello, the first call on the line. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning. The first call calling from. Can you hear me? Yeah, hello. Yes, hello. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, can you hear you very well? Okay, we are now live on air, and we are the first caller. Um, how may we help you on today's show? Okay, thank you so much, brother. Uh, I hope you are with the barista. Barista is sharing your clean clear if Nazabodaya. Yes, I'm hearing oh. you, my brother. I'm hearing you, my brother. Welcome. Okay, brother, I'm, uh, I'm so happy with you. Good day, my 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 honorable barrister. God bless you. I'm Mr. Edwin Ibe. Edwin Ibe, yes. Yeah, I'm calling from Germany here. Okay, from Germany. Uh, yes. Do you have any hello. questions? Do you have any questions yeah, to ask? Yeah, yeah, I have a question to a little question, but not a question, no, but uh, contribution. Uh, sorry, pre yeah, please. I'm just coming from from travel right now, and uh, I was thinking, I was thinking about the about the the issues right now. I was arriving my 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 house right now, so I thought I would join the because I know that I know that my my brother also my also my bro also my 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 Af my Biafran food. We'll be yeah. on the line today. Yeah. Brother, I did respect you. I did respect. I greet you, my brother. Um, it will be more nice uh, if you um, maybe listen back to the today's program. If you follow no, us. No, please. No, please, brother. No, please, brother. Please, brother. Please, brother. I'm just coming back from travel right now. I said that I will call you. Let me okay. tell you that. That's why I didn't we meet are, you last time on just, the line. We are just oh, starting all right. now. All right. We are starting. You can call us then later. Just call back in some minutes time. Just listen. Join the program. Listen to yeah, today's, but, today's uh, article. Yeah but, bro yeah, but, yeah, but brother, this is not a, qu a question, but I just, I want to ask Barista about it because I don't have time, please. All right, go ahead and ask. Then, you... Ask, ask, ask oh. what you want to ask so that we we'll proceed, my brother. Okay. Thank you so much to give me the, uh, yeah, the little welcome. chance. Uh, okay. Barista. Yes. Uh, please, uh, please, 
like uh, right now we are we are fighting for our nation Biafra eh? yes and the a lot of people always making video this this this, this calling Igbo 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 but in my own thinking I'm thinking that uh, Igbo is our that's our that's our dialect. So somebody wants to make a video, you don't need to say Igbo. You can call it as a Biafra. Why? Like uh, the other place and the liver state, they are not speaking Igbo. You understand what I mean? They are not speaking Igbo. It's only a little state, Anambra, Enugu, Owere, some places is speaking Igbo, but others, other places, all also within which, which we on the same nation, not speaking the language. If it makes sense where somebody can can make it like that to say Igbo, because I have uh, some friends here, like Delta, they are, they are short, they are little, they are little aggressive. At any time, people have to make a uh, have to make a video. They always say uh, Igbo, Biafra, Igbo, this, Igbo, this. I think it's more better for so somebody to make a video about Biafra. To make it Biafra, because uh, Igbo is the that is the language for yeah, the Biafra. Yeah, yeah. That is my um, own opinion. That's my that's my we, own opinion. Okay, the, but the program we are doing is the roadmap to get Biafra. Nobody is talking about Igbo. Somebody may call on. No, I'm just and, no, yes. no, no. This is just coming in, into my mind. What I'm I'm coming I'm, I'm coming from travel right now. Okay. I want it's to okay. ask, but okay. I know I I know. I know, I know it's not your program today. I know, but I'm, this can just enter my brain. Sorry, please. Okay, then. Thank you for calling in, my brother. Um, we may proceed then and uh, get back yeah, to let's, you later. Yeah, let's proceed. Okay. To... Thank you. Okay, thank you. So, um, Barisa, we, we should proceed yeah. then. Yes, yes, we have proceed. Um, Barisa, please, uh, can you please set your camera very well? Because uh, yes, yes, now you are you are posing. Yes, yes. Is it okay uh, now? Yes, it's it's okay. Uh, can you hear? Can you see me now? I can see you. That is uh, perfectly, sir. Thank you All for right. that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, barrister, um, yes. this um, uh, article is all about uh, the roadmap to uh, getting our Biafra. Yes how do we go about it um yeah when we were talking yesterday or a few days ago i said there were three ways to get independence and now um we've come to i mentioned the three ways but the thing now is how do we go from there first since we know or we have agreed that everything has a process and uh, achieving independence is also a thing that has a process it means that there are rules there are regulations there are laws governing the achievement of independence and now it comes under international law a people seeking for independence there are conditions to fulfill before they will be granted independence. Okay. There are conditions. You can't just wake up and say you want independence and you get it unless you want to use the military method and fight a war. Which we which, doesn't want. Yeah, which we don't want. And that's why we are going to the legal methodology. So if we are going through the legal methodology, that means there is a process you must follow yes now the international law says for you to get independence there are conditions you must satisfy yes now you must satisfy the condition of having a definable population mm -hmm. and we have and we have that definable population inhabiting a definable geographical location and we have that uh, we have it how barista 
Our yeah. population can be can be ascertained. It can be ascertainable, definable population in an ascertainable or definable geographical location. So we are in, we inhabit the southeast, parts of south south, and parts of middle belt. Uh, <laughs> excuse me, sir. The problem now. Okay. On. We inhabit the southeast. Parts of South South and parts of Middle Belt. I didn't say South South or Middle. I said parts of. Hmm, that's an argument. <laughs> Good. So we inhabit the Southeast, parts of South South, and parts of Middle Belt. Now I I said parts of. I know why I said parts of. It is not the whole South South that are in support of Biafra. It is not the whole middle bed that are in support of Biafra. So there are parts that are in support of Biafra. But the beautiful thing is that they live in the contiguous region that can be ascertained. That is, their population can be ascertained. Okay. The rule of international law is that so long as it is ascertainable, even if it's disputed, even if the boundary is disputed, but so long as it is ascertainable, that will be worked out during the boundary adjustment program. Even though Bakasi? I'm not talking about Bakasi, I'm talking about Biafra. Bakasi the Bakasi, is also the one, of, no, the, the one of Bakasi has been clearly demarcated by law. The court made an order and they produced the maps. I have the maps that were attended in the international court. I have so the, the the law the court made an order and that map that was sent to the international court which was used to do the uh, the, the the dispute resolution that is the adjudication mm -hmm. defined the territory of bakasi which was given over to cameroon but that if one, at all we acquire biafra don't we have the right to you are going too far. Let us first get Biafra before you go to that level. But is there, is there any possibility? We see the problem is that Biafra, you you you, are, you you jump before you get there. Yes. Now, you can't fight for you can't fight to get uh, Bakasi now, can you? No. Good. Okay, if you get Biafra, then the Bakasi people say okay, they want to join their kit and king. They now join. Is this not true? Yeah, but if, what if Cameroon resist? Are you going to force Bakasi people? Suppose no, Bakasi I said, people if Bakasi people want to join their what you just mentioned, their kit and king. Yes, and yes. Cameroon said no. It's not ready to give away that territory. <laughs> it is not possible. If if the people, if the indigenous people of Bakasi say they want to join the Biafra, their kit and king, you can't stop them. Uh huh. Problem. But that is not what we are talking now. You are, you are, you are getting, you are taking this thing to a different. Yeah, in fact, for I want, my people, my people want to know about it. They are right. Why they? Why do they want to talk about Bakasi? Going to fight over Bakasi when we are not yet there. Let us no, first the, get the, the question. Diaspora. The question says state, is stated: If we succeed in getting Biafra, is there any possibility? For us getting our territory and our brothers back yes it is possible if the bakasi people agree to join biafra okay they okay. have to agree to join biafra in fact when we do you know that do you know that in international law the size of the country the size of the territory doesn't really matter it can be as little as emo state and it will become a country uh -huh. In fact, Imo State is even too big. There are so many countries that are not even up to one million people. In fact, in international law, there's one country that you, they, they always used to give us example, Nauru. Nauru is 10,000 people. She didn't calculate her job. Oh, oh, and ah. Wow. Yeah, so it's not even the, the, the size of the territory or the largeness of the population. No. But there are certain things you will meet the conditions you will meet and then you qualify for uh, independence and you'll be granted independence so we have the we have the population 
we have the territory, but we have we have our territory is not yet defined, but it's definable. Okay. It's definable, it's ascertainable, but not yet ascertained. At the moment, the Afrans have been recognized as a people, but not a, a nation state. The Afrans have been recognized as a nation, but not a nation state. We don't have a territory yet. So we are Biafrans living in Nigeria. So we need to get to that level of controlling a territory. And how do we do that? I don't know. It's either you fight a war to control a territory or you take it by political power. How then do you control a territory? Oh. It's either you use war, fight a war and take over the territory or you use political power to take over a territory. There are two ways. So yeah, don't be that but, but, but if we don't want to fight, let, let's put it that way. We don't want to fight a war. We don't we don't want if you don't want we to don't fight. want war. You know, no. uh, we want everything peaceful because I believe Ojuku went to war because uh, there are these tools that we are holding today wasn't in existence by then. So but, the the tools were the tools were in existence, but they, because but Ojuku is a military man, he was a military man. But anyway, what I would say is that the situation that they were confronted with at that time required the action they took. Okay. If someone, some somebody wants to cut off your neck, is either you resist him or you give your neck for him to cut off. Like so what is up? Like what is happening in, in Ebolan now? Like yesterday in, uh, in in Abia State Tower, military people just assassinated young boys that are on the street. Is, is that is that what not the same thing that was happening in North before Juku was was angry? What do you mean? By, what do you mean by military men assassinated people? I don't yeah, understand. They are killing unarmed people on the street. What what happened? What caused it? Nothing. They they were on the street. They did nothing. They did not attack the military. Military said that they were sent to calm situation on Abia State. Shooting the boys, standing around, drinking. You know how they do in the evening time. And I don't know whether you have been in Abia Tower in the night. If you go there, it's like a Ikeja bouncing like marketing. People are moving around. It's as if Eziba uh, Hanazo, you know. But they were, they opened fire and everybody picking it. They thought that it was kidnapping or ki criminals, but at the end of the day, it comes out to become military. That they were pushed well, to come and come to the really, Well, I don't really comment on what I don't know. Uh, the facts I don't know properly. But As a barista, be, I know. Yeah, but, yes. I wouldn't be able to comment on things. I don't know the facts, the proper, proper facts. I don't know the details. So I wouldn't be able to comment properly. But if military men just saw some people and started shooting them, that is wrong. Uh, I would like to know why. I would like to know what happened. So, but the thing is this, knowing what Nigeria is, that's why when I joined us this struggle, I warned the people who were with me that Nigeria is a very dangerous terrain, very dangerous place. And that it's a, it, once you give them any excuse, they can kill you and nothing will happen. Don't give them any excuse don't give them any opportunity um if 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 someone now begins to boast that he will kill or he will destroy nigeria and then they now say okay let me let us go and test your power and they first strike you for you to strike back and you can't strike back what happens then you are weak yes now so these are some of the things i have had many Biafran leaders or activists boasting, boasting of how, what they are do to destroy the Nigerian army, Nigerian police, what they are going to do to destroy them. And then Nigerian army or police, being what they are, they can now decide to test you and kill your but, own but men. Barista, is that not uh, inhuman? Uh, it is inhuman. It's dangerous. It's evil. There is tear gas. There listen is water now. cannon. Listen, listen, and listen very well. Okay, sir. Nigeria is a very dangerous country. Very, very dangerous country. If you give them opportunity, they will kill you and nothing will happen. They killed Delegiwa, nothing happened. They killed 
the attorney general of the federation, Bola Ige, number one lawyer in the country. Nothing they can kill you and nothing will happen. They kill Abiola and nothing happen. And that's what I'm telling you. It's a very dangerous country. So how do you handle them? With wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. And you get what you want. It doesn't mean weakness. Wisdom does not mean weakness. Yeah. So if you now say, if you now boast, you boast that, okay, I'm very strong. I have thousands and millions of soldiers. I'm going to destroy Nigerian soldiers. Then you boast and boast to their hearing. One of them will kill one of your boys and say, okay, let us see. And what happens? Nothing. You can't kill back. Yes, we know it is evil. They are dangerous. Don't ever give them opportunity. They are evil. You don't want, they don't want to listen. The Africans don't want to listen. Let them go ahead and continue wasting lives. And wasting life, but it's the wasting life, you know? Highest, you will shout that, oh, it is uh, inhuman. It, it is against human rights. It's against this and that. Yes, they know, but they will do it. And nothing will happen. Highest, you complain and complain and write and write and do whatever and protest and protest. Nothing will happen. Uh, but Barista, um, to my own best understanding, United States made us understand that they went to war, they went to um, they, they went to um, humanitarian war in Iraq because Saddam Hussein was killing his own citizens. Why are they dormant in Nigerian Biafran case? That is what I'm telling you now. There is a conspiracy against Biafra. The international community. Why didn't Biafra succeed in the first time? Now, in the first time, remember many countries, some countries uh, supported us, African countries plus Haiti. Yes. Zambia, Ivory Coast, Gabon, you remember those countries that yes, supported yes, us? Yes, yes. Plus, plus Haiti in, in the Caribbean, they supported us. Why was Biafra not admitted into the United Nations even after having five countries that recognized Af Biafra. In international law, recognition is part of the condition for admission into the United Nations. But Biafra was not admitted. Why? <laughs> assuming that one world power, assuming that France or Russia or one of the world powers supported Biafra, you know that Biafra would have been admitted into the United Nations. And Biafra would have stood as a sovereign nation. It means those countries want nothing in the eyes of the world. That is it now. And I know, but then when we natural one, there are people ruling the world. If you don't want to know, know it now. And then what? But then when when they get cocoa, cocoa beer. I want to be realistic, and I want you to be realistic. Even this Biafra activism we are talking now, there are men, Biafra men, who will talk now and it is over. Don't yes, you know that? Yes. You know yes. that? You know that Biafrans, There are Biafrans that uh, that occupy high, prominent, sensitive positions in the world politics in the world. <laughs> At least I know two. <laughs> you know some of them. Yes. You know some of them who can be in their bedroom now and telephone Buhari. Telephone of uh, 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 Trump, President yes. Trump. Yes. Telephone. You know, some of them can telephone the heads of countries. Of I different... know at least two. Uh, you know at least two. There yes. are as many of them in. I mean, Biaf. If they take their telephone now and call this world power, say, gentlemen, um, we have actually decided to be free from Nigeria. It's over. And then what? But then when when did they call we to to end? <laughs> at least our sister. I don't want to call. I said our, our senior sister. If she be called, I said it's, it's enough. It's enough. Something will happen. I don't want to mention names, but their friends have people that can take the phone now, call the world leaders now, and it is over. But we try, we scare them away and make their activism to be like childish things. Child. We just. We, when I enter the struggle, 
I tried to bring them in. That is how I was able to get these elders together. Elder statesmen, intellectuals, we started moving, and many world bodies or countries, the world bodies and some countries, we are now paying attention to us, giving us audience, and we are moving until everything got scattered. Amazing, can you mark like childish things, abusing elders, abusing countries, abusing governments, abusing every authority? They're now looking at us like childish. Chinese play that we are it's like we are making we are joking because we don't know the <laughs> the gravity of what we are looking for so anyway i don't know what else to 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 do just let me just teach teach if you are willing to learn fine if you don't if you are not willing to learn fine whatever but one thing i know is that what i would like us to do is lay the foundation if we don't get the biafra in our own generation our children will get it. Hey, handing this suffering over to our children, not a good thing, no. <laughs> what can I say? Since we, in our own generation, we have decided to destroy things we have built because of jealousy and antagonism, and hey, it is horrible. Okay, I'm talking about conditions for you to be granted independence. Yes. I, I've talked about a sustainable uh, geographical location and population which we have what about the another condition of de facto governance de facto government i have that had a, something like that before a people looking for independence must be organized under a de facto government in their land a body a leadership structure a de facto leadership structure that will be able to organize the people manage the people control the people, govern the people within Nigeria, within the country. That was how, that was the, the essence of establishing the customary government headed by the Supreme Council of Elders, so that they can gather their children together. Yes, when I brought up that concept, some people say it will not work, some people say it was illegal, some say it was unlawful, that is against the Nigerian law. I said what? I, I had to fight it. When I gathered the elders together, of course, the elders, that was the first time, they said, Emeka, I hope what you are doing is correct. I said, yes. I sat them down and told them, say, listen, under the customary law, you have the, it is your power, it's within your power to gather your children together. Now, since after the war, all of us scattered, and it is, you are, it is in your power to now ask questions and say, after the war, all, my, all our children, where are they? How many are remaining after the war? It is the elders of the land that have the right to gather their children together to see to their welfare, organize them, control them, discipline them, just like in your family. Who gathers the people in your family? Is it not the head of the family? The father. If the father exactly. is not there, the first son takes over. Exactly. It, the same thing applies. The elders of the land have the right to gather the people of the land to see to their welfare, organize them, you know, cancel them, uh, uh, lead them, discipline them, warn them, guide them, and so on. It is a, it is a customary government. Yeah, but Barisa, you know that people are afraid of corruption and compromising. Each time you say people are afraid of corruption, people, why do you, why do people just give unnecessary excuses to gather yourself together? Okay. We now started, the elders agreed and started, and we started putting things together. People are now being gathered together. We established the customary government and using the town hall meetings to gather the people together. The only limitation we have now is that we have not been able to get our bill passed into law. But as soon as the customary government bill is passed into law, you will see what will happen. But we shall succeed. Yes. We shall succeed. That our bill, customary government bill, shall be passed into law. And then you will understand what we are talking about. So things have processes. And you don't jump it. You just have to go step by step. But it's unfortunate that as we are trying to build, some people are scattering. <laughs> Do you know that right now, 
some people have even destroyed the or they have even set up another another castle of elders some even have gone to set up another customary government. They went to one native doctor in Agolo, one shrine, Agaba Agolo, something Haba Agolo, to set up another customary government. They, every person wants to have his own government. My God. In fact, they even, they even removed Dr. Ikedife and uh, said, another, oh God, it's a shameful thing. The next thing I heard was, um, Colonel Achuze is now the head, and the another professor is now this. And um, they, they say that uh, 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 His Royal Majesty Ezozobu, because of his sickness, that uh, uh, another person has taken over from him, but that is not true. In 2013, when His Royal Majesty, the Honorable Justice Ezozobu, came to the Federal High Court to worry and addressed the court and addressed us, right there, he conferred authority on the deputy chairman, that is Dr. Dozi Kedife, and told us that Dr. Dozi Kedife will act for him in his absence. And he addressed us and handed Dr. Dozi Kedife over to us that he is the one that will be in charge. That that he, the, um, the, 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 his lordship, Justice Zodobu, that he, he is not always available but that his deputy chairman dr dozi kedife will always be with us but, but so after it's, it's, excuse me barista after, excuse me sir um please yeah why must our people keep on creating copying something that is already in existence turning this game to try this something that no well, learned person will take them serious well uh, it's unfortunate that after his new majesty his lordship met that addressed us and left dr dozi kedifena took over and addressed us and every person was rejoicing and rejoicing and the the customary government continued but because of jealousy envy all these things i don't understand listen i i i don't know i'm doing my, i'm doing what i'm called to do that i'm doing what i am I'm trained to do. I'm a lawyer. I studied this aspect of law, international law and diplomacy. I studied policy and strategies. I studied the, the things I'm doing. I am an expert in the things I do. I don't envy those of you in engineering or sciences and some other things you do. I don't know those things. I don't know anything about those things you do. But I know the ones I do. I know what I studied and what I can do. And I'm an expert in the things I do. I'm an expert in my fields. I am. I have three professional colleagues. Yes, you may have heard. Yes, I am a barrister and solicitor. I'm an estate surveyor and valuer, chartered surveyor and valuer. I'm a chartered management consultant. All these things, yes, I'm trained in them. I'm qualified in them. I have professional certificates, qualifications in these things. So I do I do the things I know how to do. So I was able to set up a customary government, was able to gather the elders together, construe them into a, a council called Council of Elders to govern the people under customary law. And I've drafted the bill to pass into law in our House of Assembly. I am a lawyer. I know what I do. Now, these people are ignorant or they are jealous. And what do they do? They try to destroy everything I do. And they have set up their own customary government. And here, these are the people who said customary government was illegal. And the federal government uh, 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 wanted... So when that thing happened, federal government came, challenged us. And I fought back. I challenged the attorney general of the federation. Let's go to court. If you can prove that customary government is illegal, then arrest me and arrest the elders. The caller on the line, if you call, your line uh, will be frozen. I don't know why, because uh, I'm getting so, the signal. So it's quite unfortunate that um, our people can even mislead some of our elders. And uh, those people that have formed their own customary government or formed their own council of elders, these are the people who who colluded with some elders to write to, a, to the federal court to say that I am no longer the lawyer 
for to do the case and i didn't want to fight them because i don't want to disgrace our elders i don't want to because if i go to court to challenge it the elders will be disgraced because i am the one who fight the case i'm the one who paid the fee yes because the, the enemy will be seeing you people they that don't have any fighting. document yes they don't have any document of instructing me or paying the fee the court fee i paid it i started the whole thing yeah uh, Barista, you took a very so they wise will be decision go to, if i take them to court they would be disgraced and i don't want to disgrace our elders so that's why i left the case yeah you did well barrister because if at all you have done so um that thing will um I hope the voice is coming through. Yes. Okay. That thing will make the enemy to laugh at us and uh, exactly. start exactly. pointing hand uh, that uh, now exactly. they are fighting each other, they are killing exactly. themselves, exactly. which is against our own the things that we believe in. You know. Exactly. Mm. Exactly. Thank That's why I left. That. Thank you on that. Um, mm. But Barista, there is something that you mentioned last time that we were doing videos about this. Our brothers, they are killing on the street. You said. There is nobody out there taking documentary of all that is happening. Yeah, it's something that should actually be done. Somebody should actually be taking um, uh, statistics, doc making documentations of what all the things that are happening. But um, who will, who will? It's a, it's, it is a project that we can take up. But nobody is sponsoring us in these things to start that project it costs a lot of money for us to do such a pro project it's a project a project by the time you finish it you see volumes of books you write a project that you can actually tender in court in, in time to come but it's unfortunate Be because i believe that after second world war the jewish people started taking yes. documentary and exactly. registering everything that exactly. happened within exactly. their people in europe yes. and at the end of the day german paid them damages and uh, yes you need to have, doc about it, have to document these things but uh, it's unfortunate now we if you if people want to sponsor us they want to help us donate to us we will do it we we have many at the platforms now we have the human rights platform we have the civil movement civil rights movement the human rights platform the belay human rights in belay for biafra it's a human rights movement we have mobbing which is a civil rights movement <laughs> then these two bodies can can work can do projects and some others that are coming up IPOB customary government agency that, are, that is registered in the United Nations for international relations. So we have all the platforms in, read, in, in readiness for work. Unfortunately, uh, our people don't seem to uh, appreciate that aspect of the struggle. They seem to like only the, the awareness creation, that is noise making. Noise making is good, it's our awareness creation. But that is not what will get us Biafra. Yeah, it is, uh, no, I know. You yeah. can create awareness and make noise, but that is yeah, not the yeah, end. Yeah, I understand. My people, let me jump in and uh, help a little bit. Um, what Barista is trying to say now is this. The system that the um, um, Israelis followed after the war, after Second World War, they documented everything that happened they investigated all things that happened from german to poland to romania and other part of eastern europe to figure out how many of their citizens that were massacred during that second world war and today they filed everything to united nations and german started paying for reparation Biafrans, france if we let her get what we are looking for what evidence do we have to take Nigeria to court to pay for all these souls they have killed? We have nothing. We have nothing. So that's what Barrister is saying. There are agencies around under Bilie Human Rights, Mobile. Under the customary government. Under the customary government. Customary government. And uh, yeah. what's the other one under United Nations? IPOB what? Customary government agency. 
you mentioned that one IPOB in the United Nations. IPOB customary government agency is registered with the United Nations as an agency for international relations. If okay. you go on the if you go on the United Nations website there and type it, you will see it there. So my <coughs> people, if we as he as Paris I just mentioned, no nothing. It costs us nothing. It's a project that most of you back home will be part of it too in the investigation level to fight for your brothers that they are assassinated every day and when nigeria realized that these guys have opened another pandora box to bring them to book tomorrow what will happen they will reduce in what they are doing nigeria is not stupid they are also trained they know what they are doing they know the crime they are committing but immediately they notice that you have started taking note of everything you will say that those things will evaporate but we still continue to investigate from Anambra to River State. All those people that are being killed will be revealed and everything will be put back to book. All that it requires is your support. Is your support. Organize yourself wherever you are. If you believe in the truth, if you want to see the real truth and the real thing, let's do it. Not only jumping around, shouting, Hey, Willie Hill, it is happening now. They are shooting them now. People are falling now. At the end of the day, they will carry their body and throw it away, and that's it. Yes, that's what I keep seeing. That's the report I keep seeing on online. That it is happening now. It is happening now. That the zoo police have killed all those people. It is happening now. Yes, they will continue killing. But we are not documenting these things. Uh, even now, we need those we need those pieces of evidence, all those things. We need them even now to make our case strong. Um, it's unfortunate um, the people don't want to donate to our work, so we are using our 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 pocket money, and it's hard for one person to, or few people to be doing these things. So, well, let's just continue. Um, I like uh, we usually say in Gokunro, you know, I saw what you know. <laughs> no, but it's, uh, uh, we know Salah. We have to keep on uh, enlightening them. What will you do? Now? What will you do? You know, when your strength finishes, you stop. Wherever your strength, <laughs> carry you. you God go. will not allow our strength to finish, Barista. God will keep on empowering us, um, giving us the special voice to talk to our people. Maybe okay. one or two, three, four, five, six, seven people may come together and said, "Let's give them a try, even though it's hundred, hundred euro." You know. Let's give them a try and see what will come out of it. You know? Well, I have seen that. Um, well, um, I have been planning of a um, uh, way to overcome this problem. So we will go into the next um, strategy very soon. Um, the strategy, uh, I will announce it very soon. Because I have found that um, uh, the Biafrans, uh, most of them will not want to do anything that will not benefit them so okay. so i will give them something that will benefit them and then they will now contribute from that thing so i'll give them something that will benefit them they will make money i'll make that i'll create something that will make all the Biafrans very rich just watch and see <laughs> all... <laughs> when i don't hear them listen when i don't hear them some... okay well. <laughs> that's a project i have and i'm going to release it very soon and it will make all the Biafrans very rich. If you are not lazy, if you are not a lazy person, yes, you will be very, very rich. You can't complain of of uh, poverty anymore. I will release it very soon. But I was before Barista, before you release it, I will go to Facebook and check those people that insult you. All their names will be noted, though. <laughs> no, no, don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> if, if they don't if worry. they apply, <laughs> they will get rejection uh, by no, me. You know, don't worry. Listen, let me tell you something. Let me give you a prophecy okay those, those people who accused me who insulted me who abused me will eventually love me more than you can think of just watch you see when you have zeal for righteousness and it is channeled to negativity when you eventually know the truth that your zeal will now turn around and you will go to extreme positivism what do I mean by that? Check the life of Saul, who became Paul, for instance. Yes. 
He was very zealous for God. Killing and destroying the Christians, believing that he was doing the right thing. Yes. So in his mind, he believed he was serving God. He was doing the right thing. He was fighting for the truth. Until he now saw the light. Then he now knew the truth. And I said, oh, so I have been fighting in the wrong direction. Then he turned around. That same zeal that prepared him to even walk more than all the apostles that were before him. You are getting my point? Yes, sir. So all these people who are very zealous, who threatened to assassinate me, who called me names and so on, very soon they will see the truth. They will see the light and they will know the truth. And they will turn around and I will be their best friend. Just watch. I believe what you are saying, Barista. Yeah, because truth cannot, truth cannot be destroyed. You can lie and lie and use propaganda and use propaganda. Eventually, propaganda will expire because propaganda has expiring dates. Yeah, because if people keep on waiting and nothing is happening, no nothing happens. On the ground. Somebody, for instance, somebody now says, "If you arrest me, I, the, the, my followers will burn down Nigeria." Okay, fine. Let us analyze that statement. Hmm. How do you burn down Nigeria? If you burn the houses in Aba, have you burned down Nigeria? You destroy your own block house now. <laughs> okay, if you burn the trees and farms planted in your backyard, have you burned down Nigeria? You are killing yourself. If you burn the market in a ba market in Onisha, have you burned down Nigeria? You are still in Tukuntuku, still in your place. So, how will you now go to Asorok or burn down Asorok? How will you burn down Asorok? You will first of all get it before you put on fire. <laughs> so, you need to get your fighter jets and bomber fighter to, get to, uh, uh, to go and bomb us rock and we will watch and see how you but, do but, 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 sir, there is one news that just came in somebody just sent me something and no he writes to me he said that uh, have you heard that the man ruling us is a uh, is plastic surgery from Southern sudan have you gotten such thing i saw it i don't believe all this propaganda i don't believe them Okay, if it is if it's a plastic surgery from Sudan, what uh, what next? But why should uh, our Senate allow plastic surgery to continue? Who told you that is plastic? How do you how do you <laughs> prove that? Who told you? <laughs> that is uh, you know that Trump Trump said that he don't want to talk to BBC and say that that they are fake news. <laughs> that, so that, 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 that Facebook. Oh, that what, <laughs> the thing is this the thing oh is this uh, propaganda has gone to a level that even educated people who don't have discerning spirits will be deceived even lawyers i have seen lawyers who have been deceived by false propaganda but our people are oh. buying to it why should they do that for instance now, no for instance i have seen on facebook they'll bring they bring a photograph you know this thing they call um photoshop photoshop or yes, something yes yes eh? yes yeah well, they'll bring the photograph yeah. of uh, obama obama and give, where he's holding the biafra flag and saying uh, i support biafra you know then you shout it or uh, a uh, photograph of uh, trump and, and where he's pointing a, a hand and saying i i uh, that um maybe that um I challenge uh, uh, Buhari to do this and say, hey, that, uh, 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 that um, uh, Trump, uh, is Trump, now on Trump, Trump is on our side. Trump is on our side and is now, he has given order to, Shaga, to Buhari. You know, such things. Or that uh, the uh, uh, um, Israeli Prime Minister is angry with Buhari and they will bring out photograph of his Israeli minister where his, his face is, is looking angry and he's talking, you know, that, you know, you may say, let Biafra go. And they say, the Israeli Prime Minister has said. Yeah, they are doing you know? a lot of things, so, heavy lies and manipulation. But uh, any relationship that starts with lies and manipulation never would. Yeah, so what happens is that those international communities, those, those countries in the international community, will be seeing these things and they will be laughing at us. 
they'll be laughing at us. Then Trump will see it and he will, oh, or his aides, his uh, PAs, and so on. The Russian president will see these things, oh, and they will just be shaking their head. And so, because uh, the Biafra activists have reduced the thing to childish thing, you know, it's quite unfortunate. It's quite unfortunate. Lies and lies and lies and lies and propaganda and propaganda. But, but uh, if we continue do, to do things the way you are setting it up, things will come back to normal. How do you do it? It has been destroyed and it's difficult to rebuild. I'm tr we are trying to rebuild. It's so difficult. You know, it's easy to destroy things, but difficult to build. That we can but, achieve it gradually. Let's, well, let's continue now. Let's continue. Let's continue. So, um, we want to go into that aspect of de facto government. And so, and all, the, all the people that are listening to me now, I want to give you assignment. If in your country or in your city where you live, you have not um, started a work for the Biafrans. Now, I want you to write to me, um, write to IPOB Biafra, that's IPO Biafra, IPO Biafra at yahoo.com. Let me, Ipo let me, Biafra. let me put it in writing. IPOB I-A-F-R-A, Ipo Biafra, Ipo Biafra. Okay, I-P-O-B, Biafra? No, Ipo Biafra, I-P-O Biafra, I-P-I-P-O Biafra. Okay, Ipo Biafra at? Yahoo.com. Ipo Biafra. Ipo Biafra, okay. Um, Ipo. So, Barista said that you can write him on this uh, email address. Yahoo.com. Ipo Biafra. I've just typed it in now. Yo, I got, yes, I got it right. Yes. Ipo Biafra at Yahoo.com. Yeah. Just write to me. Tell me that you can organize the, the town hall meeting in your country or in your city or in your village or wherever you are in the world. Just tell me that you can, can organize the town hall meeting, the Biafra town hall meeting. We are operating under customary international law. The town hall meeting of Biafrans all over the world. Just write to me that you can organize the town hall meeting of the Biafrans living in the country, wherever you are. And then I will tell you what to do. I'll get in touch with the country, with their government, the government of your country. And everything will be done properly in accordance with customary international law. Just you tell me. I will you get won't in touch be operating with... under illegal platform. No. It will, it will get be legal. The... Yes. I will get in touch with the government of your country, any country where you live. Just write to me. And then we will get there. When we establish the customary government in order the Nigerian legal system, I also notified ASOROC, the presidency. So what we are doing is not illegal. You know? So don't worry. If you are willing to work with us, you are welcome. And we want to work with all the Biafrans who believe in the legal methodology. We shall get there. Yes. And uh, um, um, George, I would like to ask something. This platform is Miro African Television. And uh, I have my guest. I will not tolerate anything that will bring you in into my platform and you start throwing your insults. Nobody invited you to this platform. You came on your own. And uh, writing rubbish on this platform, I don't fancy it. Either you withdraw it or I, report, I will report your own account to Facebook. With everything that you just wrote will be presented before you. I'm not joking. I can do it. I can kill your account. I have the capability to kill your account now under three minutes. Everything that you have in that account is worthy. Please stay away. I am not here to flex my muzzle or my fellow brothers. But respect yourself. God bless you. I, I didn't know. I don't know who you are talking to. But it's like he, someone is. Yeah, to... he, he knows himself. Okay, no problem. No problem. The thing is this, um, it is clear. Any person who wants to follow the due process, you are welcome. Follow us. 
we know where we're going. We know the way. If you don't want to follow the due process, you want to follow another way. Go ahead. We're not stopping you. That is it. I hope you Wait. get what Barista just said. If you want to organize anything wherever you are living, write him, give him the area where you are living, he will get in contact with the government, and everything you are doing, nobody will threaten nor shake you around. It's something legal. And uh, he's not forcing you to drop your own wherever you belong and come out. No. If you know you want to give Lega method a try and see whether it will yield out something, give it a try. I will not. We are going to land in the same joint point at the end of the day. Either you come from left or right or corner, but our final destination is to get what we are looking for. Thank you. So, <clears throat> yeah, so uh, what we want to do now is to have the town hall meeting, the Biafran town hall meetings, customary town hall meeting in all parts of the world. Anywhere, any country in the world, you can, if you can organize town hall meeting of Biafrans, just write to me. I will get in touch with the government of your country, wherever you are. I will, I will from here, from London, I'm a, I'm a solicitor of England and Wales. I practice in international community. I practice in Nigeria. So I will get in touch and they know me as the solicitor for the Biafrans. They know me as the solicitor for the Biafrans. So I will get in touch with your country, with your government, and give you, we shall give you the directions of what to do. And everything will work out well. You can't be struggling for Biafra and be afraid. No, we have passed that stage. Unless you want to commit a crime and then whatever happens to you, that is on your head, not me. If you're following our own instruction, nothing will go wrong. So, Barista, I think uh, we have made it again. Thank you very much. We'll <laughs> continue tomorrow. Yes, God bless you, sir. Thank God you for bless. teaching and enlightening our people. Thank you. Omo Biafra, at least uh, Barista have tried to give you this one full hour every day only to lecture you upon the insult that most of you are throwing it doesn't mean but who reach there who do the room barista can you throw the last word yes all the bear friends all my brothers and sisters anywhere you are in the world listening to me now i encourage you be strong and of good courage we shall make it it's not easy but it is doable because god is on our side the, the message of freedom is from God himself because he says, you shall know the truth and the truth shall set you free. Yes. And he wants all creatures to be set free. He doesn't want slavery anymore. He wants all creatures to be set free. This is our year of Jubilee. We have entered the period of Jubilee where when all the slaves must be set free. So we are going to our freedom. Therefore, my brothers and sisters, I encourage you, love one another. Stop evil speaking. The Bible says, speak evil of no man. Don't speak evil against any man. So, please, love one another and continue in this way. Follow me in the pathway of legal methodology. That is what I preach. A due process is what I preach. And I'm asking you to follow me in the due process and we shall achieve it. Just like other countries have followed the due process and they have achieved it. Military method is no longer in vogue. It's no longer the fashion now. What we now need is brain. Brain. We now use the brain. Not, not might, not physical, but brain power. We shall use brain power and we shall get what we want. God bless you. Remain blessed. Remain blessed. Thank you and good night. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you. Good night for now. Good night. Uh, good night. <laughs>
Special greetings to my people. Um, many are insulting me that my English is not perfect, but the only answer I will give to you guys is that I'm an Igbo man and I'm proud to be an Igbo man and I'm proud to speak my own language and uh, I'm also happy that I can be able to speak the British English to address you and some other people. Um, I'm not master in English, but I'm master in my own father language, mother language. I'm perfect on that. If I cannot say anything, I can speak French, I can speak English, I can speak Igbo, I can speak German, and uh, Arab. Five languages. How many can you speak? <clears throat> Maybe the only perfect English. You are trying to insult me that I cannot speak English? You have not even done anything to promote your own language. You have never ever challenged, even though you are a child at home, that why are they talking to you in English without your own mother tongue? You are proud that you will come to the Facebook and call the British people evil empire. You will insult them. You will tell them, you will tell them all sorts of bad, um, uh, we call them all sorts of bad names, how they put Nigeria, how they sit on Igbos. At the end of the day, you are proud to promote their culture. Who is the foolish person? You are making yourself the most foolish man on planet. Don't become the Indians that we are asking for payment because of colonization. But, let me pick a call. Okay, they call on the line. Where are you calling from? What's your name, please? Good evening. Good evening. Can you lower the volume of your... Okay. Yes. yes. Okay. All right, I will do that. Okay. Good how are you? I'm fine, sir. I'm and fine. you? <laughs> I'm doing well. I couldn't call in earlier. I watched um, um, the barrister. Okay. Uh... I'm glad that um, you came to this conclusion. Uh, um, I believe um, that is based on uh, how much you, you have endeavored to um, bring him on, you know, to um, continue him, make a retro, come with him, you know. So, um, it's a very good conclusion. I just came in while he was going away a few minutes before he, he exited the program. Okay. Uh, okay. And uh, I just like his tune now. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't know why he arrived at this. It could be because of how much uh, you impress this interest of uh, him achieve uh, this uh, our dear friend. Yes, sir. Um, that's a good job on your side. I know <clears throat> you might know that I always tell you that um, you constantly like to dig deep in Ottawa, so, and this is... Um, um, one of the things that I've seen about you, uh, before I get then I become a trainer. My man, I'm then I work in our house to be My brother, you know, so you have a plenty of other language that you do speak, you know, so and um, English is not our primary language, though. I do come on, I saw you, but now, but I'm more, much more of my own primary language, just to see you, which you know, been much better. <laughs> so we are gonna uh, 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 what I will tell you let me tell you my brother, don't respond to those people. Just me when he name because the more whatever you want to respond, they know how to get you aggravated. Whatever he can marry just a bank to name because uh, uh, I must tell you is um, you're doing a good job. 
You know what I was so, but one thing that gladdens my heart tonight, I mean this evening right here in the U.S., um, I believe that um, irrespective of um, our differences in Ottawa, yeah. um, we, we, we just have to examine ourselves. We go and we evaluate, we get it, uh, to what we say to each other in Ottawa. Yeah. And as long as this uh, struggle, they continued. There are other talented people. Are you there what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But I always believe one thing. You see, this uh, Emeka Siri um, uh, has been... They started this struggle, you know what I yeah. And um, he is a behind the scene man. When you're not behind the scene, does not mean that they are not doing anything. They do better. Because the one, you know, in front, I'm going to say, why would you know, I'm going to say, empowered. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and this is exactly what I want to tell um, um, the barrister, that um, the, the history will not complete will not be complete until I hire Batadia because I hire Nadia already. It's only that people are not um, calling him right now Geisha Pokwa um Elaya Nam Dikalo. That's why I'm aware that now. Nam Dikalo is also doing great on his own calling. Calling on Kia um Kenya Nakwe to I mean to put them um, structures on ground which is also unique. He's not even against yeah. any other person. Rather, yeah. not as say, oh, they create go awareness, perfect and fine. Yeah. They tomb down room, okay. they push his to the wall. Let me start yeah. laying structures. But they create more awareness in the guy, you know, like, yeah, you know, because more believe. Exactly. Now, here is Scotland. And when they yeah. push you for referendum, yeah. they give room for them on a parliament. He may activate. Yeah. Which they did. Exactly. Okay, exactly. spread now. No, they push you their own. Their people in parliament yeah. have not yet adopted it. Maybe tomorrow or next, they will adopt it. They push you for, uh, for referendum. You know? Yeah. But our own, yeah. no, everything must end on the street. I got a street. I okay, know. I got one on the street. No, we, we cannot all be there. No. Mba. 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 Ka wo, I mean, that is also part of the zoo behavior. It's also part of the zoo behavior. I mean, we should explore all the avenues that are available to us. You know? Yes. Uh, so that um, they will, I mean, will, they will not um, uh, take us by surprise. Like you rightly said, if we are called upon tonight, I said, okay, this is Biafra. I know without a structure, I mean, uh, it's um, it's also it to also look like uh, we've not done anything. You know, that's why the yes. we've been on, yes. on the street for years. Yes. So we cannot be able now to put the structure in place and um, take the bull by the horn. You know, come out in a better form. Somebody now, but, but I believe I somebody will you wear. Okay. Okay. All right. Hello, the caller on the line. Can you hear me? Hello. Yeah. Hey, issue with your boy. Daddy. Good evening. I want to chill. Yeah, well, let me know. But let's stay up. But let's stay up for the too much. But let's stay up for the too much. Huh? Is it a but let's stay up for the too much? Who for the too much? I'm not sure what is motive in this issue. Yeah, but you know, we will teach it the best way, the other way to follow. I need to hang out. We got quite a few of them. Yeah, because is he, is he trying to demoralize people that want to uh, bring out their, 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 their efforts to actualize this dream? Because you don't have to worry about it. You see, if you don't have to worry about it, you don't have to worry about it. No, 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 no. In a mere misunderstanding. On a second... If on radio and I, I did this uh, um, um, streaming anime now, it's awareness. Mm. You get a go? I need create awareness, I need create awareness, I need create awareness. I create to get one year, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Why there is no structure on the ground? Give me a chore on all of now. You know, I can't be a chore on all of it. You got to be a chore on all of it. 
one day to give a talk about it all. A sumo boy here, a good foundation. My neck like a gaga man on lever. You are, are beating around the bush. You get a look, and uh, he's not uh -oh. even trying to press anybody out a bit longer. He's selling you as we are creating awareness. Drollo no one and they might tell an honor. Let us start now on the matter of an honor. Tea waste not on the ground. And that's not to get it. Who it it will only land in that body. These politicians in line at Barry, we will later need them tomorrow. But all can man a bit of no get because you don't want a half in that body is in the politicians. Neku hip that now today I need the big hack. I can tell our I can tell our winners. You they are the one that will sit down and activate our referendum. I couldn't have a party stack. We be a France when a people. Who have a refund today, more world leaders, Biafra Lawa, without even any other thing, they will press Nigeria to grant that referendum. But they are not doing it because we, you and I, doesn't know doesn't know their value and doesn't have respect for them. And that one, Nanya. Yesterday, what happened? No more What happened? No more rights. 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 No for 200 and net. But all the time, very, very bad. I can't even imagine France now. I can't even imagine France now. And then I'm going to change here to France flag. I can't even expect they did the same thing. I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. Nobody. Yes. I wonder how now, you know. I wonder how now. I wonder how now. Let them be calm. You have to pride. You have to be in it. Let them resolve any issue. Personal issue. I want it. Let's work. Team hand. Team work. Team work. I get my our dream. Teamwork. You understand? I don't have to have anything. You want to do it. You want to do it. You You don't want to do it. You want to do it. You You want to do it. 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 You want to You want to do it. You want to do it. You know, one minute, let's pick another caller. Okay. Hello, the call on the line. Uh, what's your name and where are you calling from? Okay. Um. Okay, are we still on, on the show? Yes. Please, I would we, like to speak we, uh, we of, of the show. Okay, please, uh, Mr. Zebedee. I love the work you're doing with the barrister. Who am I speaking with? Please? I would like to speak of... Okay, sorry. My name is... is uh, Okay, Chiku Henry. I called before before my call went off when the, I was in part five for part five of this show. Okay. So I would like to yes, please. I love I love I've I think I've uh dissect and digest all he has said and I took take my time to watch all the videos. I think the man is making a credible sense to naturalization of our uh, nation Biafra. Like, I uh, will want to call offline so that we can uh, make okay. a headway to, okay. to the future, yes. Then uh, you if call me in the next, in the next uh, 20 minutes. Okay, no okay, problem. Okay, uh, Mr. Zubedi. Sir. All right, um, do, you, do you want me to go offline so that... Um, the only thing I want to hand up the room, the, and the, I call him the address, uh, Mr. Zubedi. That's the email address. Call IP... Uh, Ipo uh, Biafra at Yahoo.com. Yeah, that's right, yes. Yeah. Okay, that is Ipo Biafra at Yahoo.com. Yes. Okay. Um, I'm hello, going to. Hello, Mr. Okay, yes. I'll write him and I'll send him an email, okay? Okay, then, sir. Please uh, try it. Okay, I will. Okay, I'm going. Okay, what about that? Yeah. Okay. Bye. So they call hello, me Mr. Like. Yes. Yeah, is it possible for me to get uh, the, the barrister's number? Uh, actually, he wanted to give me his number, and I made it to. I tried to inform him that uh, it's better he get a second line. You know what I mean, you know, in case okay. of any. Okay, I understand. Understand you. Yeah. So maybe you okay, get it. Okay, that's wrong. When we, when we speak offline, uh, you will understand better, sir. Okay, you will call me. You will call me in the next twenty minutes. It's okay. I will do so. I will do so. Okay, thank Keep you. Keep on the good job, sir. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Bless you. Bye bye. So one issue we could win. The thing not there. Um, um, every um 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 message is relevant. You get to go, but 
it's good to lecture the people around you. What I don't like, more one not here was a baby. More fish work away. Or to colonize my people. <laughs> you know, the colonial masters have yeah. come and gone. We don't want to participate in, in zoo politics, but we want referendum. Go and read referendum. How referendum is being activated. How referendum is being held. It's those people in Senate, those people in legislators, will they legislators one get activate that referendum. And how do they do it? And when they have project in Nigeria, where and when they investment in Nigeria. You are threatening them that they won't be after and handle like a leg side. One day, one on our force here, you know, as a as a guy, one day, you know, I want one boy, it's short as a issue. I got there, I don't know. One nugget, you know, 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 you should go ahead on the very very important then in the chocolate can name me and a ticket structure on the ground should write him on that email and order it no day he will contact your government and they will set things right i will not know that in the police about you soon so no wonder belly you never here it will be well registered and well it will be legal let's put it that way you get a go and my mother would have to do as any country you find yourself or say I get in Nigeria, say in any country. He's not joking, my brother. And can you cost right to give him a try? It costs us nothing. Well, they have to work hand in hand now. You have to work with Nam the Kalu. You can take a horse to a river, you can't force him to drink. Nam the says, Oh, what they are, my. He doesn't believe in Nigerian politics, period. Anything legal way, he's not with it. Then it then means he gets Gazia to the hard way, and the only way we get it. But Amawala Amawa, Gag on news, Nigeria said that they push their special squad to Eastern region because of getting unstable things in that place. It's the nigga, they told their political and the legal method now nigeria have sent in their military abawala hunu na ya state na ihun loge ka legi ya he do were mbo gba he se wonu gba de aka amawe umu aka wusrala apapere se he be were akwezi no loka he tipi ala oya wudi we from anambra edu river to river state na won mo ai Abara ke oroja sabara na no were the rade one no nye kugo no body no 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 rat is 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 making noise nothing you are died if you die you are gone if they kill you they waste you you are a wasted product finishes with it's better we withdraw our young youths that may lead us to glory tomorrow for them not to die in the in, the, in this Cattle area uh, military guns. They are not using tear gas of these guys. They are not using rubber bullets. They are using life ammunition. To life ammunition, you. yeah. To provoke you. Come and challenge me. Let's let's battle it. I told my people last December 2015, the type of military I saw in Eastern region, I said, <laughs> you are claiming that you want to fight Nigeria. Why they have already dug in in your own territory? And you are still preparing to fight. Better call it off or you face the wrath of Nigeria. Go and ask Li Liberia what they did in Liberia. Or should I call her alone? These guys has no mercy. They has no mercy. So the best answer to that is gonna to follow and disease. Whenever you see them on the road, you are not bulletproof. Keep off. If they disappear, you may come out later. But as far as they are still there, please, the only thing you can do for yourself is do what? Go and take cover. That's all I have for you, my brother. Because the only thing I want to do is to go to the next level. But it's the only thing I want to do is to go to the next level. I want to go to the next I joined that two two heads is better than one. Yeah, like all, I all, all the government, all the government. We have been we have been talking everything at the go. Okay, that's why 
he wants everything to continue now. Let's start again, you know. All the goma, you know. Yes, two heads better than one. Onye wo tidy, onye wo tidy. We actualize our dream. But time be do ba mumu so we get one time to achieve our dream. Get one name at that. You buy one, you buy one. Cross this against our brothers, against our 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 dream. Let them try to me actualize, you know. So yeah. let's work together. Let's everybody forget about the past. Apa, apa let's bury the hatchet. Let's do on that. You do not say. I want to know that you don't have someone zooming here. One, I'm not a child. I got away back in that. And when you're my little no one, a full year now for my island. Yet I go. And when one of my friends on your rivers, oh, mom, on our one now, river state, I would toss now. They would say, I bet I have been seeing the name the Carlo visiting river state. I have not seen that man and the moon dimension carrying sitting around on Nam the Carlo. We'll get to that area. That is to tell you they still keep distance and watch. So, one uh, that's all I have for today. Thank you for calling in. And uh, we may talk offline then. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. I want you to listen to me. So, my people, uh, we have tried for today and. Uh, I would like to call it a day from now. Udo Druno, Yaga Zero Mo Biafra. Wow.